The Great Reopening 2021, now coming. All right, so hey, everything's reopening again. You're an artist, you're a producer, you're a beat maker, you're a florist. I don't know what you do, but uh, this is mainly for artists, music people. Um, what are you going to do? Uh, here's some tips to keep in mind as the great reopening happens in 2021. Now coming to a theater near you. First things first, we're reopening, okay? It doesn't mean that, uh, you know, everything's changed and the whole world is completely shifted and the human has uh, one year later become a completely different person. They're all humanoids. Uh, it's just not true. All the bullshit you hear, man, everything shifted, everything changed. I promise you it really hasn't. Uh, after a year of coronavirus, people being inside and stuff, uh, they're just back to their old ways, man. I went out the other day. I see Hollywood Boulevard. I see people, no mask, drinking, getting drunk, talking and spitting in people's faces it's all good we're right back man right back to humanism all right so humanism 101 uh yeah people just want to have fun right so make sure that you are connected with your people uh your music you know everything you're doing have a mailing list have a text there's a really great little uh, uh i guess it's like an app or something but it's called community you can have people opt in to get text messages from you great way to stay connected with your audience with your fans with the people you're serving uh tell them about live shows that you're doing right in dallas texas in uh, portland oregon you know just just let people know also mailing list build a mailing list stay following up with your mailing list uh have have merch printed out right like even if you're going to go play a little show at a tavern in san diego outdoors have some merch ready you know people are going to pay a lot more money for your merch at the show while they're listening to the song and getting to know you you know than they are online with a with a shopify account so just a few things right there just to get you going you know a uh, big thing about really reopening is that you're going to have a lot of people not really ready to come out and watch your show right so another thing i would say that would be a really great thing to do is bring a camera with you bring a friend with you um, that shoots on their phone it doesn't matter like capture the experience so you can put it up on your uh, patronage account or you can start using it for clips on instagram to promote your next show right so you got to really think strategically with the with the artist game and i realize a lot of artists just want to drop records and they want to just like blow up on their records and get you know distribution earnings and mechanical royalties but i'm telling you right now that is not the number one source of income for artists it's merchandising it's it's um you know creating buzz and 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 using the platforms you have right now which we have a lot right now we have trailer we have um instagram you got facebook you got the community app i just uh recommended to you a uh, mailing list where you can follow up with your fans uh you can monetize on youtube you can monetize on doing live streams with twitch you can do a lot of stuff to monetize your industry and your music artistry so as we're starting to reopen you got to think really strategically like uh if you used to bring out you know 300 people to a show think now you'll probably get maybe 50 people right uh, to that same show. So how can you create new content around that show? And how could you monetize it on Patreonage or release songs for just for your fan base online, things like that, and start to bring the online and offline and, and bring them together? Because obviously also a lot of the bars and places you're going to play, they can't do 1,500 people stuffed into a venue anymore, right? They're going to have regulations because of the, the COVID thing. And maybe your city's different, but every city's going to be different. So just uh, think about all these things and be prepared. That's my uh, my biggest tip for you. So there's some creative stuff for you. Uh, Patreonage account, make one, right? Start releasing music to adjust your fan base, charging them, you know, for your membership levels, etc. Uh, get into community and and start a text uh, opt-in so you can text and connect with people a little bit deeper. Uh, email list, start hitting them, you know, start hitting them once a week, twice a week, once a day. I shoot out emails once a day to my mailing list because I want to stay connected with them. I want them to know what I'm doing. I want to know what they're doing. I want to I want to see how their music's going. I want them to come into the YouTube lives. I want them to see the new content we're putting out and uh, learn and keep growing with us so that's about it hopefully you love that tip of the day if you did go ahead share it um, tag someone below that would really use this information especially as an artist that was making a lot of money on their touring and stuff and um, that's it for now